either today is Saturday and that means there is a market in Kerry Kerry. We're going there and we'll show you some interesting sites as well. Kerikeri is a small town sitting at Bay of Islands northwestern edge at the mouth of Waipakakora River. Blessed with its semi-tropical climate, surrounding hills are covered by orchards and plantations. Kiwi and avocado dominate, but there are also plenty of oranges, mandarins, limes, lemons, grapefruit, blueberries, persimmons and even bananas. This well-to-do society of orchard owners acted as a magnet for various artists, artisans and art lovers from around the world. Today, Kerikeri Keri is one of the most cosmopolitan small towns in New Zealand. Even our weekly market is organized in an old fruit packhouse. Islands is also the cradle of modern New Zealand, associated with the arrival of Europeans. It is worth to visit several historic places from this not too distant past, which are still standing in Kerikeri. Keri. At the river mouth, just below the last rocky cascade, is a small port with a jetty. Next to it, you can find the oldest stone building in New Zealand. It was originally supposed to be a port storage, but during the years it served also as library, school, army barracks and today houses a souvenir shop at the ground floor and a small museum at the upper floor. Several historic buildings nearby today house stylish restaurants and cafes. And on the other side of the river we can find Riwa village, a reconstructed Maori settlement showing ways of Maori life and culture. Further up the river, there is a beautiful walking track. Here we can find remains of one of the first New Zealand hydropower stations. Currently, its construction was requested by wives of first British public servants. And this is how New Zealand hydro generation was born. Today, almost 90% of electric power in New Zealand comes from hydro schemes. After a few kilometers, we reach the Rainbow Falls, the source of water for the power station further down. Kerry Kerry's boat is access to sea is limited by a narrow, shallow and winding river channel. The main marina is located further away, in Doves Bay. From here, it is much easier to get to all other beautiful Bay of Island sites. We will show you more of these in next episodes.